For dental implant procedures, you do some bone grafting. Uh, what's entailed? What's involved? Yeah, well, we do we do bone grafting, and and sometimes people are very apprehensive about bone grafting because they remember the old way of doing it, where it might be coming from the hip or the leg, and um, and now it comes um, out of a bottle okay. usually, and uh, it, it may be donated bone, it might be synthetic bone. There are different options that we talk to the patient about, but it doesn't involve a second surgery to do it. And, uh, and we just use what's in the bottle and we put it in to the area where we need to create bone or grow bone. And it usually takes about three months for that to happen, but there's, there's no more discomfort in doing this than in taking the tooth out. Okay. It's just something that gets added to the site where we remove the tooth and then it gets covered. So uh, actually people don't report any any more discomfort really from that. And then it's just a matter of time because the body, whatever material is used, the body comes and eats it away because a lot of a common question is, oh, oh, does this get rejected? But I, I always answer, yes, it does. Okay. And uh, because we want it to, because it actually just elicits the body's bone cells to come and eat it away. And at the same time, it lays down new bone okay. and faster and better.